yo yo what's good everyone welcome to my channel i am a sage who rises today i will be doing the sun moon rising of scorpio so let's get into it so angels what's the tea for scorpio so scorpio somebody is overindulging in gossip this is somebody who is targeting people and it's because they know that they're not gonna speak up for themselves we got wants to sit around just to steal your work ideas. Your God said not going to happen. They're blocked. We got healer here. So you could be a healer. We got protection. 444. Four, four. Your angels are with you now. Let go of fear. And then we have pay these people no mind. They want you confused so that you do the opposite. Stand 10 toes down. And then we have they're not even able to face you. Wants you to suffer because they want your energy. Then we got a mother and daughter plot to come off your energy. So basically, you got some weird shit going on. More of the story. So let's see what's going on. Why is overindulgent and gossip target people who they know not going to speak up? Yeah, we got the star in reverse. This talks about somebody being in despair, being preoccupied by negative thoughts. This is somebody who has some type of lack of faith or lack of inspiration, lack of creativity. Yeah, with the five of pentacles in reverse, this could be somebody that is going through some type of negative changes in their circumstances. Two of wands, so they chose this path. Two of cups to partner up with someone. And now they're getting karma. Page of pentacles for whatever they was invested in. Lovers in a committed relationship. So somebody was in a relationship and they made some type of investments, which is getting them karma because they partnered up to choose some type of path because they was in poverty. So, yeah, why just want you to stick around? Yeah, this could be a couple. Again, they're making investments and they took some type of action when it came to some type of money or they took some type of action to pay a queen of wands to sacrifice you so that you can go through some type of heavy burden i'm saying this person is going to have to walk away from doing magic this could be someone from your past that wanted you to be mentally stuck and trapped in some type of conflict here and they missed the opportunity because they were being exposed why is healer here the scorpio why is healer here yeah, with this two of pentacles, I'm saying that you are going to be able to balance out a situation because you are a healer. With the full card, you will have a new beginning. You just need to have faith. Ten of swords. Because somebody wanted to basically betray you. They wanted to be your enemy. Four of wands. This could be you going through some type of betrayal that a community created. Knight of cups. A bunch of... A bunch of people in the community came towards you with some fake ass love, but with the four of pentacles in reverse, I'm saying that you're letting these people go. Moon card in reverse because you've uncovered some type of secrets. Three of cups about this group who has been working together. Ace of swords, and that's the truth. Why is protection? Four, four, four. Your angels are with you now. Let go of fear. Yeah, the full card. You're being told to let go because you are innocent in the situation. And like I said, you will be able to bounce back. That's the fucking truth. I'm saying that somebody want to come towards you and be sweet now because they're going through some type of ongoing battle. But it's because they're under judgment. So you got about six people under judgment who did not want to give up. Now they want to apologize because they're saying that you know the truth and you're able to bounce back and have a brand new beginning elsewhere. Yeah, Emperor, this could be for Tim to Divine Masculine. Hermit that ghosted you. So this could be about your divine masculine ghosting people. Okay? Queen of Swords. Setting clear cut boundaries. <laughs> Why is pay these, pay these people no mind? Yeah, pay these people no mind because whatever magic they're doing, they're going to have to walk away from that shit. Mm -hmm. Three of Pentacles. This is a group of people working together. Knight of Wands taking actions without... You know, thinking about the consequences. Hermit, I mean, not hermit, but the Hierophant. These are people who basically want you to conform. This could be your Divine Masculine's family. I'm also saying that somebody is married. Your Divine Masculine, this could be a King of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. And this could be the reason why you're in a Nine of Pentacles, self-sufficient, single, independent. And this person could be wanting to communicate with you. This is somebody that's at a distance from you, okay? Somebody that you have a family with. Why is they're not even able to face you? Why is this here for Scorpio? Yeah. 
Page of Pentacles. This is somebody who jumped on the bear wagon. Three of Cups with a group with a bunch of fucking groupies. Now they're getting karma and blocked. So somebody's karma is to be blocked here because you've already completed a karmic cycle here. I could be talking to a King of Cups. I'm saying that you're getting victory and success because somebody missed the opportunity to cause conflict for you. This is somebody who was competing because of a partnership she was in. This person is getting fucking karma. Why is wants you to suffer because they want your energy? Why is this here? Yeah, five of wands in reverse. I'm saying that um, somebody wants to compromise. But with the four of cups, they missed that opportunity. Six of wands. I'm saying that you're getting victory and success with a king of cups. And it's the end of that cycle. So, cards is conformity. So, babe, you, you ain't got to do shit. Four, four, four was in the middle of the fucking reading. It's like somebody, I guess they target you, gossip about you, okay? I don't know if you wasn't speaking up for yourself. You just let people just run on top of you. But I really don't feel like that's you. <laughs> I feel like somebody thought that was you. Yeah. They were sadly fucking mistaken. Let m Must I say, they were sadly mistaken. Yeah, guardian. You got angels, ancestors, and spirit guys is watching over you, fool. And they want you to open up your heart, Okay? Mercury retrograde is on its way. Yeah, we got Mercury retrograde. They'll be back. My son, he's on the most. But if you're having some type of communication issues with someone, okay, it could be because of Mercury retrograde. Even though I feel like Mercury retrograde is about some time out. It's Saturn retrograde right now. But, yeah, I really feel as though there's some type of communication issues going on. Possibly with an Earth sign. Yeah, they'll be back. What we got going on for Scorpio? What's the T for Scorpio at this time? Yeah, the T is open up your heart. It will help you to attract love. Water sign. Yep. What we got going on for Scorpio? We got challenges. Make a decision. Work on your inner healing. Give it time. Listen to your intuition about a pregnancy. Health. So some type of health issue could arise. This is a cycle. You're being told to basically... Hmm. So there are some health issues arising here. This could be karma. This could be fate. I'm saying that you will be traveling soon. But you do have a spy that's doing magic on you. And it's because they want you to move. Hmm. Well... Why is open up your heart here for Scorpio? Yeah, a king of wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. This person wants you to open up your heart. But you're independent. This person wants to communicate. This is somebody that's at a distance from you. That's feeling mentally stuck and trapped. Weighed down because of an ending. So you could have been dealing with an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. And they want you to open up your heart so that you guys can communicate. But I'm saying that you loving the single life. Just period. Why is water sign here? Yeah, Six of Cups. Six of Cups is Scorpio Energy. Yeah, Queen of Swords, Scrim Card, Empress. So, you could be having some type of nostalgia energy about a Scorpio. This could be somebody from your past shit. This could be a friend. This could be a family member. This could even be an ex. I'm saying with the Queen of Swords, you need to set boundaries with these past people. Stand in your power because you are the Empress. Okay, yeah, you coming up as the Queen of Swords, Scrim Card, Empress, and you got like a water sign. This could be a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces from your past that you're having nostalgic energies about. You could be dreaming about this person. You're being told to stand ten toes down in your energy and mean what the fuck you say because you are the Empress, okay? And somebody is trying to lay some shit to rest for you, basically trying to slow you up. This could be a Queen of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is somebody who betrays you, and they chose this path because of a masculine energy who they was working with. This person is going to have to walk away from doing some type of magic because you, baby, you could be married. Somebody could be trying to attack you because of a baby daddy. Like, bitch, get, get your life together. Why are challenges here? We got to make a decision. Work on your inner healing. Yeah, six of swords. So that you can move the calmer waters. It's time for you to heal. 
make progress, move on. I'm definitely seeing that things is calming down. This is the calm after a storm. I'm seeing that you're overcoming some type of difficulties. You're being, you know, saved by your ancestors, your spirit guides. The Six of Swords talks about you being, you know, moved to calmer waters. Devil. And you could have been dealing with some toxic ass Ace of Cups love offer. So somebody could be obsessed with trying to make you a love offer. I really feel like this challenge is coming because you need to move away from toxic ass people and choose love. Seize the moment. Because you feel as though you have to make a tough decision, but the only thing you have to do is do things in moderation and be strategic on the moves that you make. Because you got a king of pentacles. This could be a Taurus. This person took some type of action and they went spying to see if their wishes was fulfilled. But I'm saying that you got victory and success over any obstacle that this person tried to put in your path. And they're being exposed. King of Swords, that's the truth. And they're heartbroken for even coming towards you with this fake-ass love in a community. So you got a weak-ass bitch. This could be a Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. This person tried to come towards you with fake love. And this could have been towards your twin flame. Okay? Your soulmate to cause you challenges. But the only thing you have to do is move on from these toxic ass people, toxic ass behavior. So say like um, you drink, okay? Because I seen the double and I seen the temperance. Basically, you know you need to know when to drink. Drink at home. Drink by yourself. Don't go out drinking with bitches that you know don't fuck with you. Shit like that. Don't go out. Don't go out to no family gathering drinking, knowing that all these people do is talk shit about you. You know. Why is give it time? Everything in divine timing. Let things flow. Yeah, seven of swords in reverse. I'm saying that somebody is in hell of regret. Temperance. Because you are an earth angel. Two of swords. Who they tried to distort. Nine of swords. They see some type of moment. Ace of cups when it came to either a new beginning, a new relationship. And it's because they are obsessed. I'm saying that somebody has some type of mental health issues. And with the Six of Swords, this is why you need to move away from this person. Nine of Cups, this could be a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. Somebody who try to act like they fuck with you, but they don't. This person is heartbroken, King of Swords, that you know the truth. And that you're making head over heart decisions. I'm saying that somebody is being exposed. Period. Why is intuition? The red flags you ignore now will come to bite you in the butt later. Yeah, magician. Somebody is doing magic. Ace of Swords, that's the truth. I'm saying that you need to listen to your intuition. You know somebody is doing magic. You know that truth. And if you don't listen to it, you're going to be in the Ten of Swords. Okay? Somebody is trying to curse you. Queen of Cups. And it's going to backfire. Because this person is in competition with you. Only because you're being seen as an innocent person. Who was able to bounce back and overcome any obstacle that was in your way. So let me repeat this for you. Listen to your intuition, okay? Because you know somebody is doing magic. You know this truth. I'm seeing how you get victory and success is you balancing out a situation and basically going down a new path. Somebody is competing with you and it will backfire on the Queen of Cups. This could be a Libra, uh, Aries, Capricorn, Pisces. Uh, yeah, it's going to backfire. So listen to your intuition. Nine of cups, because your wishes is going to be fulfilled anyway. And the only thing they're going to be able to do is to watch. Because they took some type of action here. With this Taurus and an Aries. And missed a motherfucking opportunity. Because it's an ending to that fucking cycle. So let them keep playing with their life. But don't you go around motherfuckers knowing that they doing magic. If your mind say they doing magic, they doing magic. Why is health issue could arise? Why is this here for Scorpio? Yeah, full card. It says you will be free. You will be able to bounce back. And you will get victory and success over any obstacle that's in your way. You just need to focus and be determined. Ace of Swords, that's the truth. Somebody is doing magic and they're going to get karma. Double karma. Whoever this couple is who was plotting and planning just to think that they was going to receive good news, they're going to be in hell of regret because you will be able to heal. And they're going to be in poverty. Right along with this Pisces masculine who could be their family member. And this Taurus, 
who did some energy switching with you, oh, this bitch missed the opportunity. It's the end of that cycle, and they're being blocked and exposed. So, yeah. Mm. Laugh at they dumbass. Trying to keep you in a cycle. Like, girl, if you don't move your dusty ass on, it's really giving bitches be making believe in their own stories. What we got going on for Scorpio? What's the tea? The tea is somebody bankrupt. They, they, they bills is overdue. And they got legal issue problems. That's why they want to come in and try to kiss your ass. Yeah, you're dealing with a happiness hater. Okay? <laughs> yeah. So somebody is a happiness hater. And they're stalking you. They're stalking you because they see you as this boss daddy or this boss bitch that's stable, rich, a business owner, CEO, big, big energy, big cooch energy. And they, <laughs> they obsessed. I mean, hey. Why is bankrupt here for Scorpio? Yeah, stock are. This is somebody who wants to heal with you. That's at a distance from you. <laughs> I'm saying that this King of Cups is moving on, though. We got Queen of Swords, Wheel of Fortune. So, this is all to do with your destiny, Queen of Swords. I'm saying that you're moving forward with a King of Cups. And somebody at a distance could be wanting to heal with you. Page of Wands in reverse because they're receiving bad news. And they're going to have to walk away from this ongoing battle. Because you got victory and success over this family who was out here lying on you. These bitches is under judgment for even coming towards you with this fake ass love. Knowing they was plotting and scamming with this queen of pentacles who was watching you. This bitch was in a group of, with the people. This bitch was in a group for strength. Partner up with people. And it's the end of this karmic cycle. Like I said, somebody was fighting at all costs. A king of wands. <laughs> Why is legal issues, court, judges, immigration? Yeah. These people that partner up with each other for strength? Yeah. These three by three bitches? Oh, they watching you, boo. They sure is. With they toxic ass. I'm saying that toxicity is what they chose. When it came to you, high priestess, now they heartbroken. Cause um you are going to be getting what you you are going to be getting what you deserve. And that's the motherfucking truth. Why is happiness hater here? Oh yeah. This happiness hater could be a queen of cups with the four of cups. This could be a cancer. Uh-huh. I'm also seeing Scorpio. You got a happiness hater. This is why you need to reject this motherfucker. Hermit. This could be a Virgo in their lover. They thought they wishes was going to be granted. If they did this work on you to betray you and hold your back. But whoever this king of pentacles is, this is a divine masculine. And this queen of wands in reverse. So hold on. We got a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, father figure. And then we got a Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, no, a Taurus, Rigor, Capricorn, father figure. And then we got an Aries here with this Emperor. This could be someone's mother. That's a masculine energy, four of Wands in a community. They took up impulsive ass action and something is about to backfire in the ass. Why is Boss Daddy, stable, rich, business owner, CEO, big dick energy? Why is this here? Yeah, it's the source. That's the truth. That's the truth about this king of swords. This could be a Libra, Gemini on Aquarius. Somebody wanted to paint a picture here in the past to cause you a heavy burden. A king of wands. This is an Aries, Leo, a Sagittarius masculine who wanted to win at all costs. And they did not want to give up until the cycle was closed out. But I'm seeing that you had the script to overpower two of cups this couple. Because they wanted to take something from you, hun. A queen of pentacles. So we got a king of wands and a queen of pentacles. Uh-huh. This queen of pentacles was heavily invested in coming towards you with this fake-ass love. Now they both is under judgment for lying on you to a whole family. You got victory and success. Sure do. So I hope it was worth it. Yeah. They are this bitch stalking you. And not even moving in silence so you know motherfuckers is stalking you. That's the crazy thing. Like, bitch, the fuck is you stalking me for? Worry about yourself. And what you got going on? Yeah, somebody lost. 
this couple who was wishing on your motherfucking downfall. They lost. What we got going on for Scorpio? What we got going on for you, Scorpio, is death. We got death here. Something is about to end. Some type of curse being on your gift that somebody did in the past. So, yeah, there's an ending to some type of curse. I'm saying that you're being gifted for what you had to endure in the past. Yep. Why is the death card here for Scorpio? Yeah, somebody tried to harm you with a fucking curse. Yeah, devil. Somebody was literally obsessed. I'm also saying that it's the ending to this toxic ass couple who thought that they can cloak their fucking self. Something is backfiring on this King of Pentacles. Sure is. Four of Swords. Something is being laid to rest. Ten of Swords after a betrayal. Eight of Pentacles that somebody worked very hard to do. Nine of Cups just to bring in some type of wish fulfillment with a King of Cups. Why is cursed here? The Scorpio. Yeah. Somebody sees the moment to try to curse you. Moon card. And what they didn't see was eight of wands. Whatever they were sending towards you to cause this ongoing battle, to win it all costs, whoever this king of wands is and this queen of wands in reverse in a community, run along with this queen of pentacles. So you got a king of wands, a queen of wands in reverse, a queen of pentacles. These are people in a community. Six of pentacles. They wanted to take something from you. A partnership. But you had the scrim to cut cords, cut anything that was tied to these people. And that's the truth about this family. They was out here lying, cheating, trying to steal from you. And then they all on the judgment because it's an end to this cycle. So this king, this king of wands, queen of wands, queen of pentacles, they could be in a family dynamic. Why is gift here? Yeah, with the world in reverse. I'm saying that something was not completed. When it came to this couple. Who was obsessed with taking impulsive ass actions. They missed the opportunity. When it came to your queen of cups. And it's because you're responsible. You're dependable. You are someone that people can count on. And you are slowly but surely being able to heal. And I'm saying that you got a divine masculine. That is being exposed. This can even be a child's father. Or a father figure. This person is being exposed and they want to apologize for the action they took. Because they see that you see shit clearly about their distorted ass mother. Yeah. Who was watching you. So this could be your masculine's mother and shit. Like what? Baby mother? Why is memory here? For Scorpio? Yeah. Somebody is reminiscing. Six of Cups. This, this The Six of Cups is the past. Somebody is reminiscing, bro. About how they was able to hold you back. About how they was able to make investments. But they're getting karma now. Because they are about to reap what the fuck they sow. Because something is being laid to rest. After a betrayal. That somebody worked very hard to do. Just to make a wish come into fruition. With a king of cups. I'm saying that this king of cups is moving on. With this queen of swords. High priestess. This is the path this person chose. They chose love. Okay. So if this is your person. You could be the queen of swords. You could be somebody who watched tarot readers and listened to your intuition. Your person is choosing you. Okay? And they moving on. They already made their motherfucking choice. Yeah, somebody was out here planning. Thinking that they can control you. Dominate you. But that was all in their motherfucking head. Out here bullying you and shit. Why a schedule here? For Scorpio? Yeah. Somebody was scheduling shit. But was in an illusion the whole time. Ace of Pentacles. Somebody was out here paying a motherfucker to sacrifice you. To have you mentally stuck in trap. But you came out of that. And you got spiritual help with the Five of Pentacles in reverse. I'm saying that you're going to be able to bounce back. After an ending. And somebody else. They're going to be. I know y'all see it. The Death card. Five of Cups. I'm saying that somebody is going to be crying. They're going to be in hell of regret. This is three women that's in the group. Yup, because if you look closely, <laughs> the death card is going to these three bitches. They're going to be in hella regret. Six of wands while you get victory and success with your divine masculine. You will also be able to heal. Okay? Just be patient and consistent. Why is Marinette here? Yeah, ten of cups. Somebody thought they could control your love life. Eight of cups, they're going to have to walk away from that. Page of Wands, because ain't no good news in it. 
Ten of Wands, they're going to be waved for fuck down. Nine of Cups for even coming towards you with this fake ass love. Three of Swords, knowing that they've been heartbroken and that they wanted to heartbreak you. Ace of Wands, this is even the reason why they even took this action. So somebody had some type of passionate, they, they took a passionate action to betray you, hurt you. And then they got to walk away from that bullshit because it ain't happening. Why is imagination here? Yeah, somebody was in their imagination that they was going to get some type of victory and success if they caused you heartbreak. When it came to a divine masculine. I'm saying that you're healing. Slowly but surely, Queen of Cups. And somebody missed a motherfucking opportunity. Why is Bully here? Yeah, somebody tried to embarrass you, gossip about you. Yeah, tried to make you do some shit that you ain't want to. Hierophant, Temperance. I'm saying that the Divine and Archangel Michael is here. Five of Swords in reverse. Somebody has lost. Yeah, you got the Divine and Archangel Michael here. Literally. Higher fit to the temperance. Five of swords in reverse. Somebody has lost. Because you have God and Archangel Michael on your side. Five of wands. When it comes to this conflict. Three of swords. Somebody is heartbroken. Nine of cups. This could be a Pisces, a Libra, an Aries, Leo. I'm getting you strong Leo, Libra, Pisces though. Sagittarius. Wait the fuck down. Because they ain't received no good news with their baby mother. So yeah, you got a Sagittarius here. Ten of wands. This person is way down because they ain't get no type of good news with the page of wands in reverse with their distorted baby mother or mother mm -hmm, to a source. And somebody sees clearly about what this community was out here doing. This queen of wands. So this queen of wands could be an Aries in a community. This person wanted to control a situation at a distance. So they chose some type of path with you, high priestess, queen of swords. And you've already moved on and accepted a love offer. Now somebody is being exposed. Because there ain't, ain't nothing else to do but be exposed. Think about it. If you ain't going back and forth with bitches, don't that leave room for people to see what the fuck is really going on? Say like if you was going back and forth with hoes. This is probably why it says target people who not speaking up for themselves. You probably was the person that won't say shit. Just let people do what they got to do. And it's like, oh. You not doing shit is why these people are being exposed now. It's just, like, it's called a spade a spade. Somebody thought they really had, had you up on one. What's the closing message? Yeah, you've been told to release your power. Because the love is strange. You got motherfuckers acting like they love you. They care about you. They ain't nothing but a bunch of fucking monsters. Yeah, this is the calm after the chaos. Yeah. So this is the calm after the chaos, after being glamour and intrigued and drama. You know what I'm saying? That the signs are already with you, that your angels are near, and that your ancestors are here, and that you will be able to heal from some type of heartache. Yeah, look, you will be able to heal, bro. You sure would. You will be able to heal from this person that has been invading your privacy, overstepping your boundaries, and violating you, to dominate you. This person thought they learned something new, but Kylie Ma is here for them. Because the natural world needs you. And somebody thought they had a wonderful idea. But it's some type of collision of belief, styles, and attitudes. This was a tempting offer at a high price. Now it's breaking down. Because someone can miss you. That's why they holding on way too tight to your fucking energy and shit. But hey, that's not your problem. Why is calm after the chaos here? Yeah, Hierophant. It. Nine of Wands. So God is here. Somebody took up impulsive ass action and you still was able to recover. I'm saying that somebody is going to either be locked up or they're going to be the ones that sacrificed while you're in this nine of pentacles energy. Somebody is going through sleepless nights and anxiety because you're so sufficient and independent. They feel stuck, sabotaged and everything. But hey, they ain't got nothing to do with you. Why is glamour, intrigue, drama? Why is this name for Scorpio? <laughs> Page of swords. Somebody was watching. Three of Pentacles, this group of bitches, this is what they was playing. Now they're getting karma for partnering up with each other. Because you already done walked away. Ten of Cups to your happily ever after. And somebody took some type of action to try to apologize to you, a Queen of Pentacles. But this person was only out here creating illusions. I'm saying that this Queen of Pentacles in an illusion her goddamn self. Why is the signs are already with you? Yeah, the signs are already with you. That somebody is going through sleepless nights and anxiety. A king of wands. 
and the King of Pentacles. Something is about to backfire on them. Because they thought they cloaked themselves in a community, but people see clearly what this distorted feminine did and ain't got no good news in it. Why is we're here? Yeah. They're here. So this could be your divine masculine ancestors. They're saying that you will be getting victory and success over this conflict. I'm saying that somebody has to give up because the divine is here. After somebody took this impulsive ass action. Yeah. So somebody took an impulsive ass action because you were self-sufficient and independent. Okay. Why is healing from heartache? Why is this here for Scorpio? Yeah. This is your karmic justice. Uh huh. And somebody is under fucking judgment. Because you're innocent. They're being blocked for seizing some type of moment with a partner of theirs in this ongoing battle. Now somebody wants to communicate because they know that you know the truth. And this is why you're setting boundaries and standing ten toes down in your energy. Because somebody is a liar here. A whole community, a whole family. And it was all because they was being paid to create an illusion for a group of three bitches who caused some type of death that caused some type of sadness. Yeah, so that you're going to be able to bounce back and somebody is watching and seeing it. Yep, tower. Something is about to backfire on this king of pentacles and this king of wands. And they're going to be having sleepless nights and anxiety because you've already moved on, queen of swords. You listened to your intuition and you chose a different path. Page of pentacles, which is going to bring you in good news. <laughs> so, um, yeah. <laughs> Look like they did this for nothing. Because you already said hello how to heal it. Definitely when it came to this bitch that was invading and overstepping your boundaries. They really thought that they learned something new here. But like I said, Kali Ma is here. Yeah, somebody was doing voodoo. Two little witches. Because you was being true to yourself. Mm. So why is voodoo here? Why is voodoo here? For Scorpio. Yeah, now the ones. This was an ongoing battle with voodoo. So somebody was doing voodoo on your partnership. Trying to cause you to feel weak. But you persevered. Somebody was out this somebody was out this bitch paying a whole family to lie. Cause you had some type of strength to cut a bitch off. And it's because you knew the truth about somebody sending shit towards you to cause you a heavy burden. This could be a Pisces. A Libra. This person is heartbroken. Because they're being exposed. This is somebody who did not want a cycle to end. This is somebody from your past. Who's been obsessed with you. And it's because you're a healer. And they wanted to slow you up from being able to heal. Why is two little witches here? Yeah. These two little witches is in a group of three. Mm -hmm. Sure is. They wanted to create some type of illusion. About I guess the divine. Or about your spiritual connection. And then they got to give that shit up. This fighting, this bickering, this competing. Only land that you ain't getting victory and success with your divine masculine. Because you're the nine of pentacles. Mm -hmm. And this is why they took this impulsive ass action. Why is be true to yourself here? Yeah, page of cups. Somebody wants to apologize now. Yeah, somebody wants to apologize now. This queen of pentacles. Yeah, let me see something. Why is the page of cups here? Yeah, somebody want to apologize for trying to end you, curse you, or curse your gift. So yeah, somebody wants to apologize for trying to curse your gift. This is somebody from your past who thought that it could dominate you. They are the ones responsible for this. This Queen of Pentacles. Who is this Queen of Pentacles? The Scorpio. Who is this Queen of Pentacles? This Queen of Pentacles did this for merit making. But you live and you fucking learn. Because this is a motherfucker who can't even see. Now they feeling awkward. Because you got victory and success. Now this person want to compromise with a family. Who was out here pretending. Or oh, this is a family member. Or oh, this person wants you to compromise with a family. After pretending. Yeah. Collaborating with each other to treat you unfairly. This bitch is getting karma for even putting unwanted attention on you. With some supernatural... Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, this Queen of Pentacles is the one who did the work to have you in the Ten of Swords to sacrifice you. But you overcame it. And you coming out of poverty or any type of lack mindset. So yeah. All because you was being true to yourself. But like I told you before, Autumn was their last chance. 
release your power. Mm-hmm. So that's all that I got for you, Scorpio. If the message resonates, make sure you like, share, subscribe.